Hello everyone, welcome back. You're watching KJ4YZI with Ham Radio Concepts and this video is long overdue. And with the move I've had and the recent changes in lifestyle, I'm getting back to working some antennas outside and some contacts and this video is long overdue. This is the Chameleon Cha MCOM 3 Portable, a portable antenna that consists right here, I want you to listen to this. This antenna right here will do 160 meters to 10 meters and you technically do not have to use a tuner at all. I'm gonna show you this, I set it up on my tripod out there, my mast, using the Ring Expert Antenna Analyzer. Some of these bands are 1.07 to 1 SWR. The way I had it, only 15, 20 feet off the ground. I mean, the highest I saw was 2.8 to 1. So if I had a little pocket tuner, maybe I need to use that. But for my 705, always using this portable, this little 705 and this little antenna, look, that's it right there. I can do this, three things to describe this antenna. This antenna can make contacts. This antenna can be deployed anywhere. This antenna could save your life. Imagine those who are preppers or those who want to have that ultimate bug out bag. Instead of having all these traps and beams and this and that, try to set together an antenna that does 160 to 10 meters with very minimal setup and only a 73 foot footprint. 73 feet of Kevlar wire with the matching transformer on the wire winder on one side and 25 foot of Kevlar wire for the counterpoise on the other. This thing can be set up as a V, as an L, as a sloper, as this, as that, however you wanna set it up. I am gonna show you on the video, I'm setting it up very simply on that carbon fiber mask that I got from Gigaparts because that thing is already showing me five, 10 uses for it. And I'm going to set it up, long wire it to a bush out front. And we're going to see what the SWR looks like on the Rig Expert Antenna Analyzer on all the bands. And we're going to show you what it sounds like when you see real S9 signals coming into this 705 through the coax through my window. It's a cool antenna, guys. Gigaparts has this antenna, but Chameleon sent this to me. And they also sent me a couple more to give away. So watch the video because there's another one coming. You're going to give away some more antennas. Thank you guys at Chameleon. You guys are great for hooking up my fans. Let's check out the Cha MCOM 3 portable antenna by Chameleon. Ham Radio Concepts is brought to you by HamRadioPrep.com. It's never been easier to learn about Ham Radio before you take the exam. And Ham Radio Prep makes it fun and guarantees your success. Visit HamRadioPrep.com. Use the code ERIC20 to instantly save 20% off every course you buy. Remember the name, HamRadioPrep.com. Okay, so this is how I have it as unprofessional as possible on my tripod here. And I have to I have to make some of those sandbags. I tied a battery to it right now because the thing flipped over and almost went through my window. So I have it up this high. Feed lines right here going into the house. So there is the, the uh, feed point there. And I have one going out to the bushes out front and the counterpoise. So it's 73 feet going, uh, where's my finger? This way. And then 25 feet with the counterpoise right here, just, just laying, man. Just laying here. I even busted the wire, but that's where I have this going here. And I have my impasse set up right now for VHF, UHF, that I was uh, doing some wind link. But I have the, uh, here, here's the wire. Not too high off the ground. I mean, it's only in that red tree, whatever that is, and on tied to the hedges here. I mean, very, very simple. Now, when I get my tower one day uh, set up, I could set up a wire like this, although this one I keep for portable, but um, they do make a base version of this, the MCOM. And the tower will be, you know, here, and I'll have it going up. I'll have a lot more angle. But for right now, just the way this is, there it is, look. All right? All right? Nothing special. Nothing special at all. And we're going to go inside and sweep this thing, see what the signals are sounded like just with it attached to the bushes right there in the most unprofessional way. So I'm going to use this Rig Expert AA35 to check out all the bands so we have an accurate result to show you the resonance on all the bands. And if you're interested in any one of these Rig Expert antenna analyzers, check my playlist and other videos. 
There's links and in the video below for 5% off at Gigaparts for any single model that they have at Gigaparts, get 5% off. And I'm checking out every one of these, but I figured while I have them in my hand, I'll use the AA35 because it only, although this antenna says 10 to 160 meters, um, this thing is actually resonant as it appears, uh, 1.2 to 1 at 60 meters. I mean, at, at 50 megahertz, six meters. So I don't know, but we're gonna use the uh, AA35 zoom here. Let's go like this. Um, let's see, SWR meter, we'll do it two ways. So frequency, uh, let's, let's do, uh, let's start with the middle of 160 meters. That'd be zero, one, nine, zero, zero. Start. 1.13 1 to one, 24 dB return loss at 160 meters. Wow. That is, that's, okay. Uh, let's go to frequency range. We'll do zero, three, uh, seven, zero, zero. Let's do like 80 meters. Start. 1.07 to 1. Let's go frequency range uh, 0, 0.7 do 175 in the middle. Start. 2.8 to 1. Might need a tuner there. Might need a tuner there. Although I think the radio showed a little bit less, so I'm going to trust this analyzer first. Okay. Now, could I play with that counterpoise wire out there and stretch it out a little bit more or, or, or raise it up off the ground and get a better performance away from that carbon fiber mass? Probably. Frequency range will do 10, 140 for 30 meters. 1.64 to 1. Not bad. About uh, 14, 200. 1.48 to 1. Let's do uh, one, 18, 145, 17 meters. 1.98 to 1. How about 21, 250, 15 meters? 2.2 to 1. How about <clears throat> 24, 9, uh, 930 to 990, so do 950. 12 meters. 1.46 to 1. How about 10 meters, 28.500, uh, 1.53. What about FM portion, 29.620, 1.09. How about six meters, 50, uh, here, uh, oh, this one won't do 50, that's right. Okay, I'd have to bust out the AA55 uh, or whatever I got. So, okay, wow. And I'll do this. Let's go like this. We'll go to SWR chart. And I'm going to do frequency range. I'm going to do all bands. All bands. Start. Watch this. That's the whole band. And then on this analyzer, you can go left or right. And look, I can see look at the arrow here. I can see, okay, that's 1.55 at 9.1 megahertz. So if I go to 10.150, 1.66, right? Down here to 160 meters. A little bit higher than that. 1.10. Well, I'd have to I'd have to zoom in. There you go. Cool about that zoom feature on that rig expert, huh? Right here. Middle. 1.10 on 160 meters. That zoom function is cool. Look. You get my 10 kilohertz. Right, see the whole thing, and then I can zoom it out, go to a different frequency. But anyways, enough about the rig expert. This chameleon antenna is is quite awesome to have something that's that efficient. So maybe I just get a little pocket tuner for my 705, just a little pocket tuner to trim it up a little bit. Because when you're at five or ten watts, yeah, you you want to you want to use a, a some sort of matching device to get this to put out the whole ten watts when you're on external battery. But uh, as far as the signals being received on this antenna well let's plug it back in and check it out so what i'm listening here on 18160 
Copy. Kilo November 4, Lima, India uniform. They are, they are doing uh, uh, DX Kilo calls. Kilo November 4, Lima, India uniform. I have you at a plus five. Plus five. Go ahead. They're... They're doing. Steve, uh, you're five nine plus also, so good signal and uh, thanks for doing the net. And we'll listen. They're doing a net for DX to uh, arrange to contact people, but uh, you know people that are having trouble finding you know uh, DX stations. Anyways, if I go like this, let's go to. That's Laulo. I've talked to him many a time. There's the FT8 pounding in if you want to use it for FT8. Well, on an upper side digital, on the lower side. All these are five nines, look. Watch. Where'd he go? Five nine. As a sneak peek, I have two Chameleon Shaw MCOM 2 portable antennas to give away from Chameleon. And this is coming in the next video, but check it out. These are 160 to 6 meters in range, come with the wire, the matching ballon, 500 watts PEP on sideband, and it does even more coverage than the MCOM 3 portable I just showed you. But stay tuned on how to win one of these. I have two of them to give away, we'll make a video on this as well. Chameleon makes some excellent products. Thank you, Chameleon, for donating some giveaways. And we have a lot more giveaways coming up here in the near future. So thanks for watching. Check out the next video on how to enter. And 7-3. This is KJ4YZI.